I'll admit, we got a few annoyances to deal with at the moment. Uh, apparently some more rebels popped up near Snope, so we're going to just send out, you know, some mercenaries and stuff to basically deal with these guys, because it looks like, you know, it's a peasant unit and some other junk, so we can probably just, you know, kick them back fine. And they got some archers, okay. Um, can I send you out to the side, maybe? Are there any more Scythian mercenaries I can buy around here? No. Okay, move him back in the city. Can we retrain? We can. Okay, so we could retrain these guys if they get hurt. Um, this is gonna be way too much. That'll be enough, really. Yep, fight the battle on the map, all right. After all, that way I can lose as few Scythian mercenaries as possible. Oh yes, I suppose it would be. After this, we can attack Palmyra. We did send the Andres that way, and that city's got a lot of weakened units in it, so it shouldn't be bad. And glory before defeat. I agree. Is that gonna be it? Well, I suppose it's fitting. I mean, don't need a long speech before we fight some rebel slaves. Okay, so they're hanging out way in the back. Are they just gonna try and run away? No. It's gonna take forever to get positioned over here. Are they just gonna try and fall back? No, they're trying to hold that hill. Gotcha. I mean, it makes sense. I mean, having the high ground means they can't shoot ass from, you know, a tactical advantage. Okay. Now the long part, just watching them wander all the way over to the side. Ugh. We're gonna basically have to send these guys in to attack these archers. It's gonna suck. Because I gotta get rid of these archers. And as long as the archers got the high ground, I can't, you know, take as much advantage as I'd like here. You guys split off. You guys become your own group. Okay, that's a bit weird. Um, I don't understand their choice to move the archers dead center, but okay. Okay, they gonna try and fall back. Let the peasants help out? Like, you're not gonna make it fast enough. Like, the peasants aren't gonna want to deal with this. Not really. Get these guys. Everything else is secondary. Get these guys. Get the archers. I don't care about the peasants. The enemy general is running away. Seriously. The gods be praised. The enemy's hearts are full of fear and now they flee. Rum down. Get these archers, darn it. They killed off a few of my bodyguards, like four of them. Get them. Oh my gosh, they're probably just tired, right? No, nope, warmed up. Fresh. Hopefully they'll get to these guys before they all get out. I'd like to earn some extra experience, damn it. Now there's a lot of experience to be had with this battle, but hey. Ugh, they're gonna get away. At least some of them. Seriously? Get that last Steven. Get him! Someone kill him! Finally! Ugh. I think these guys lost two apiece. Yeah. Um, one hit on the Roman general. Yeah, they sustained two losses. 
I don't know how. Maybe they got when they were running down the peasants and some of them decided to try and stab back and got lucky. Ugh. Ah, an eastern turncoat, eh? Orders. Well, nothing really good here. I mean, we could pick up these guys for cheap. But the main reason to buy these guys is just to, you know, increase the population here. That's it. Like, there's not much reason to keep them around otherwise. Oh, that looks cool. I won't lie about that. Okay, we got some more rebels we want to deal with. Oh, these guys are going to stand and fight. Well, I guess they're not super disadvantaged. And they do have a general. And quite a bit of uh, heavy units, I guess. I guess we'll see how close they are to being Ryan. This being like 5 to 4. So they're not truly as outnumbered as I'd think. Ugh, I just wish, you know, mercenaries would, like, recover. Do not fear these rebel slaves. Yeah, who would? Units, my units, units, okay. Start the battle. I don't know if they're going to fall back or not. I mean, they do have the high ground. They just don't have anything else they can take advantage of it. Okay. They did leave a soft spot in their line. Okay. Let's uh, hit that center here. Ugh. Because if I can, you know, work through the center, I can start to try and surround. Yeah, they're breaking. That's why you don't want to leave peasants in the center like that. Get them. Get the running units. They're trying to form up a new line back here. Okay. I actually hit the peasants up. Uh, seems pointless. Come on now, get the peasants unit. Darn it. Form up. I don't care about the retreating units. They're rebels. They're gonna break as soon as the battle's over, regardless. Okay, I wanna smash this side of the line. Gosh darn it. Okay, go here if you want. I don't care. Just get a charge in. This time, it's not as much chaos. Okay. Okay. Okay, mass chaos, mass chaos, but get them. The enemy army is in flight. Pursue them. Get the rebel general. Get them for wasting my gosh darn time. Fine, get that. You get them. And nothing else is really left at this point. If they go away, they go away. I don't know if we'll be able to catch up to them. I mean, I would assume a rebel general is going to be like considered heavy cavalry. But, you know, it may not be. Okay, we got their leader. Okay, clear victory, yeah. Do you think with the way the game had set up, like, oh, like, like, five to four, like, it would have been a bit closer, but no. Their units basically all ran. Well, damn. He wins one battle, and they're like, promote this guy. And I'm like, sure, I could use a new commander. Conflict commander, command talent, understanding of strategy, drill master, sharp, social drinker. Yeah, he's got quite a bit. Publicly loyal. Okay. I'll take it. Now to get these units fixed up. Okay, there any units worth buying around here? No. You guys can have that damaged unit. 
Ah, he couldn't make it, huh? How sad. Um. Okay. I'm somewhat tempted to send this guy up there, but there's not much I can do with this force. As it stands. Like, it's just not a very good army. Yeah, I'll attack him. I don't care. General. Okay, now to move on to a battle that might actually be more useful. Well, the fact we managed to promote a captain you know, for a field battle like that kind of surprises me. Um, yeah, attack Palmyra. Like I said, the units here are, let's see, damaged. This unit's not damaged. This unit's damaged. This unit's almost dead. Like, I suspect attack. we'll be able to do just fine. Okay, let's begin the assault. Like, forget the other stuff. Let's just attack. Yeah, our, our odds of winning are apparently overwhelming. I'm not surprised. I mean... Their units are so injured that they can't come out. And we can easily blow a hole in the door. Though I suspect we're still gonna fire into the city anyway, because screw that city. Today we make our own fates. The omens may say that we face disaster, but I choose to think differently. Can any true man <laughs> do otherwise? I suppose not. The are the servants of Pharaoh. They think themselves our equals, but I think they are dead meat. Feels like they it. They cower behind their walls and pray for help. Many times I have faced these people, and still they are too stupid to learn their lesson. Today, men will die to teach them afresh that they should simply run away. <laughs> we go now to our bloody business! And bloody it shall be. Now let's see. Ah, oh, this is a good position as any. Okay. Okay. And Cretan archers, I guess, can go up he here. Okay. I want to fire at these guys. And then I want to move you guys... No, slightly in front. And I mean slightly. Yeah, use fire, all right. Okay. Let's launch attacks there. Uh, fire on those guys, but keep a defensive position. I don't want you guys moving forward. I have no idea what. The, oh, it's a traitor. Well, too bad for it. It's going down. Oh, come on, that was so close. Ugh. Are they gonna leave the last group of slingers that's almost dead on the freaking center? Ugh. Well, it's a good strategy, anyway, I guess. You know what, you guys can't hit the. Oh, they finally got hit on those guys. Or two. Well, that one didn't kill too many people. Okay. Well, we got a hole in the wall. Smiled on us today. The walls are broken. Our troops should be ordered forward. Yeah, they should be, but I'm not interested in ordering them forward yet. Because we can still fire more freaking Onager shots in here. Just fire at these guys, Blue. I'm curious how oh, long it's going to take them to decide to move more towards the center. Why are their shots have to suck so hard? Oh, there goes that building finally. Looks like we might end up blowing a hole in the door too.
Okay, she cut those guys. Oh, that was a nice hit. Come on. Just take down most of these uh, freaking spearmen, will you? Well, almost gone. And they're wandering back into our zone of fire. How foolish. Why they did that, I have no idea. Well, that unit's gone. Okay. And we opened the door up finally. Jeez, that shot was so far back that I almost hit them. Okay. Move them up. And start firing again. Now we're firing on the town center. Very poorly, but we're trying. <laughs> I don't know if we're gonna really hit like any of our targets here. Like they're trying to get away. Oh, finally got hit. That was a good one. Most of the slingers are gone. Okay, let's try and continue to hit them. Keyword on try. Oh, the governor's house is gonna go down. Uh, you know what? Try a left. Oh wait. Okay, we're finally gonna have to move in. But that's fine. I mean, we basically softened them up enough where it doesn't really matter. Uh, okay. Okay. Well, let the buildings burn to the ground. Uh, Our soldiers have captured the wall. Seriously? Now is the time to press on and capture this place. Run. Get out of the range of that thing. Gosh darn it. Ugh, so stupid. Ugh. At this point, it's mostly just cleanup work. Just run. Okay. Come on, hurry up. Uh, you guys at least throw stuff at them. Archers, uh, stop your attack for now. Just get them, guys. How that guy's still alive, I have no idea. Come on. Ugh. Freaking winded. Jeez, getting them close enough is going to suck. Come on. Just take these guys out. Where's there to flee to? Seriously. Ugh. Well, we took this without much of a fight. Sad part is there's probably nothing worthwhile here, because they probably stripped it of all its most valuable resources, its people. So I suspect it's going to be a... Yeah. Like, even that's probably not going to get this place to obey me. Gonna have to repair all this stuff. 
That, I'm not so interested in repairing. Screw it. And then we can build a temple to... Uh, I guess Juno, because we're going to need the population growth. This place is going to be a disloyal mess, though, for a long time. I can tell. Sapphires, I want to send those Andres on elsewhere. The problem is just where to. I mean, this would be a good place for them, I suppose. But that's way down the bottom of the map. Same thing with here. Like, you know, we got some targets we can go after our soft. We just go around this one city. And it's so tempting to do that. Ugh, I can't even put normal taxes up here. Gosh darn it. Hopefully things will go better when we get that finished. Uh, well, let's see. I want to recruit more horses, I suppose. Um, construction was. Let's see. Well, an aqueduct would probably be pretty good right now. Just to keep, you know, squalor at base. It's getting bad. Same thing here. Squalor's my biggest concern, really, probably. Or up there. Um, recruit more horses. Next turn we'll probably move and put another army together and send it up towards Scythia, probably. Um, to join this guy. Uh, we might just buy these guys. I mean, they're not probably going to be a great unit, but let's face it, we got money to burn. So we might as well burn some. Um, yeah, these guys are going to have to hold out for now. Yeah, that's pretty much going to be it. There's not much else I can do. Besides, I continue my efforts to move that one unit over there. Oh yeah, we had this unit we want to get rid of. Okay. Start tearing these guys up for uh, growth reasons. That's not the update I want. Can I even grow this town? Well, got the 2209, so at least there's that. So we can finally replace these guys on retrain. How many boats are they attacking us with? One. Fleet ready. Prepare for battle. Rope your lives. I love how they managed to leave that. I, Captain. Ready to sail. Well. Prepare for battle. Sunk them, damn it. <laughs> and I didn't even lose anybody. That guy must be a one brilliant commander, damn. That was insane. I don't know why they're doing that. Like, their faction leader is sitting here. I mean, he's called Decimus the Mad, but why is he trying to move his army outside the city? Whatever. Let's um, continue our efforts to pressure this guy. Preferably sink him. Still not sunk, huh? Finally. Thought he's never gonna sink. Okay, let's put a siege on that. And that. We're gonna have to try and, you know, cripple them monetarily now. Uh, I wonder how much longer it's going to be before we're at war with uh, Parthia, though. Well, I mean, a uh, real war, because so far it's been, you know, kind of only spoken of, because we've only had one battle with them, and it hasn't really done much. Though it looks like uh, Armenia is moving to force this way. I don't really like that. Like, don't tell me you're going to break our alliance while you guys are still fighting the Parthians, and they're losing over here. Like, this big army needs to get moving that way. Like, they have better things to spend their time on. Oh yeah, that other force thing out here, we can't really do anything about this turn, can we? Yeah, whatever. I really should deal with these rebels at some point, though. Problem is, all these towns are super disloyal, so if I try and do anything about it, they always freak out. Um... I guess I can break them right here. It's fun. 
Um, recruit more peasants, yeah. Let's just break you guys up, and I think that's gonna do it for this turn. You know, we're moving some peasants around, start proving, proving some stuff, and we'll just maintain our siege here. Cause let's face it, I don't care how long this takes. It doesn't really matter. Oh, there's some pirates over here. Or at least pirates think they're doing. Well, I'll get rid of them. I guess I'll send these guys over here for some recruitment. I'm sorry, retraining. Oh, they're gonna get experience bonuses because it's Jerusalem, yeah. That's why it's costing so much. It's not just men I gotta replace them with, it's uh, experience too. Okay. Well, that'll do it for now. Until next time then. See ya.